Hey guys, I uh, went to the track Sunday. I made seven passes. I would have made more, but at the uh, after the last pass, I had uh, heard a noise coming from underneath the car. I think the drive shaft might be scraping on the the uh, emergency brake cable bracket. So because nobody else was there, I was the only one. Uh, what happened was they planned to go Friday night. They opened up, and then the weather came in. So to kind of make up for it, they ran Sunday, then no notice until Sunday morning. So I said, I'm going to go. Nobody else was able to go, so there's no video. So I thought I'd put this up. This was in Stupor Trooper. First pass. Had 13 pounds of pressure in the slicks, 5,500 launch, and blew the tires off. So that was a wasted run. Dropped it down to a 12 PSI, 4,500 launch. Ran a 7.5 at 93. Had a 168.60 foot. I was kind of babying it to make sure it, it hooked. Then the third pass. This was 20 minutes after the last one. Had a 5,000 uh, launch. 12 PSI in the slicks. Ran a 154.60 foot. Uh, Clang third. So had to get that out of the way. Come back around. This was... Uh, almost an hour a guy crashed up there pretty hard so it ended up i think that might have been when uh we had to wait but anyway so i waited almost an hour get that out of my system at 5000 launch 12 psi 1.6 160 foot 74 at 93 it's getting a little better i was kind of getting back in the groove i hadn't been up there in a long time okay this was the fifth pass 12 PSI, I was trying to get the uh, RPM right, so the reaction time is garbage, so I had a 5500 launch, 153 60 foot, 733 at 92.6, so I leaned out the wide open throttle fuel 6%, which is like going down a one and a half jet sizes for the carp guys, 12 PSI in the slicks, 5500 launch, had a 157 60 foot, Ran a 733 again, which is good. You know, it's pretty close to what I ran before. And a mile per hour picked up 9 tenths. So, the mile per hour picked up. So, it liked the a uh, little bit leaner than what it was. But one thing I didn't notice till I got home and got to looking at the data log was because the 60 foot went down. And at the hit, when I dropped the clutch, the RPM comes down to like 3200. So I'm going to fatten up the wide open throttle fuel at 3200 to like 4500 to uh, help help it pick up from that. So then the last pass of the day turned up the launch RPM to 5700. Had a best uh, 150, 60 foot and then ran a 725 at 93.3 again. So that was it for the day. I could have made more passes, uh, wanted to. But like I said, the one guy crashed pretty hard, and that took a while to clean that up, and then uh, started hearing that noise. I still haven't been able to check that out. But that's what's going on. Uh, we're going to try to get up there again Friday night, the 30th of October. And uh, I think Kevin's coming up, so we should get some video. Hopefully we can make that. And then Saturday morning, we're going over to swap the cam, put the F-cam in McNuggles, get that going. So hopefully all that will be documented. Sunday night, and uh, he'll have a video up for next week or so. All right, later.